I always knew that he could play. That wasn't the question. And after like the second game, UCLA, Michigan State, everybody was calling. And I had to tell him, I don't want to see your transcripts because I know that, you know, they'll be turned off by it. You just got to keep working. First time Coach CJ ever talked to me about Greg, the first thing, it was uh, it was about a player on the team. And he was like, one thing I can't have you do is do that or just go to school and mess up because when you do that, then I ain't going to be able to advocate for you to school and stuff. And I was like, right, I was listening, but it was really like going in and wild, one end out the other. We created the partnership with CPS and Honors Game and they went through, you know, the students are on our roster. And she pulled it up and I was, I was shocked, like, whoa, that's your core GPA? And you're 0.3 points away? So CJ called me and he was like, hey, look at this. And, so, and he showed me and I was like, what? Like, I was like, I was amazed. Like, I didn't know that was my, what's name myself. And I was in the hallway at the time. I'm like, I'm going to class right now. <laughs> it was a huge deal for him. I think it motivated him and gave him confidence. Like I'm close. When I found out, it felt like, it was like, I, I got a chance. And I was like, if they be like, you're going to take it or you're not. That day in practice was probably the best practice that he ever had. His energy was different. He was motivating and talking to his teammates, motivating everybody to go to class. To be able to go to a, you know, a four-year institution right away and get the support and help that you need, it's huge for him. And it's huge for kids that are like him, that are from his environment. And you know, when he does sign his letter of intent, they'll be like, wow, Aaron went? I can, you know, I can do it too. And the first school that offers him is going to be based on his honors game report.